In a missing persons report filed in June, Courtney Wells' daughter tells police her mother and stepfather were going on a camping trip in Branson, Missouri. She said over the course of a week, she had attempted to call and text her mom without getting a response. She said she had a gut feeling about her mom and stepdad leaving, saying she believed they had skipped town to avoid capture due to their involvement in a federal indictment as co-owners of Big Red Sports and Imports. It's since been renamed and as of August is under new ownership and management. She said they recently changed the deed to their residence and land, making her the owner. Days after Wells was last seen, attorneys for co-defendant Chris Mays filed a motion for a new trial on the basis of new evidence in the form of emails that would exonerate their client. The U.S. attorney motioned for that request to be denied and harshly scrutinized the authenticity of those emails allegedly sent through Wells's work email. The U.S. attorney balking at the notion that Wells, a single mother, decided to become a fugitive, abandoning her daughter just prior to Mother's Day and her high school graduation saying it was more than a little hard to believe. Now, Mays is awaiting sentencing. His attorneys have filed a motion for prosecutorial misconduct, telling me today they believe in his defense. Live in Oklahoma City, Sylvia Corkill, Oklahoma Zone, News 9.